What's up, my peoples? Emgo here, the freak and geek himself, and it's time to just transform Fans Toys Chomp. So without further ado, let's just transform it. So, to begin, first thing we're going to do is just rip his head off. Put that off to the side. And we're going to push on these two panels on his chest to rotate... these sections around like so now we're going to open up the chest we're going to flip out this little section right here this little tab flip that out like that then we're going to bring up the arms and what's going to happen here is you're going to rotate the hand palm up open up the form flip the hand in close that up and then bring these toes around, rotate the arm with the bicep, and compress it in like that. And second verse, just like the first, rotate the hand out, open, that in, close that up, bring that up, rotate, and compress. And there you have the arms done for now. Take the uh, beast mode head, just untab it, and just kind of bring that up and try to keep that out of your way. So now we're going to rotate the waist 180, like so. And now we're going to work on the legs. So I'm going to rotate the legs 180, bring them out. I'm going to flip in the heel. You're just going to open all of this up right here. Fold this panel up. Like that. Now you're going to bring the foot down, bring it down halfway, and then rotate it up like so. You can bring it down the rest of the way and open all of this up. Can I get those toes out of the way like that. Once you've done that, you're going to pull on the beast mode leg, just pull it down, and then rotate it out. And then you're going to slide it up. Continue to rotate it, and then slide it up again, and that will lock it into place right there. Once you've done that, you're going to flip down this little panel here, and then take all this and swing it out. You're going to open this up, and some little moves we need to do here. We need to unfold this little section here, and this little panel, you're going to rotate around, so the green is now on the inside. So that's one side all done, and you're going to do the exact same thing on the other side. And now that we have both sides done, I know it looks like a mess, but we'll tidy it up in a bit. But you're going to come to this section here, open that up, and you have these little thin panels that you're going to just rotate up like that. And now we're going to uh, take the beast mode leg, just give it a quarter turn here, so you can close all of this back up, and what's going to happen here is you're going to bend the knee, just one click, and that will allow you to now collapse the leg in, make sure these hip skirts fold back in as well, so bring this up, you want to bend the toes in, so it'll clear all of this, and just bring it into place, then you can just push the foot up, like so, you want to bring this panel in first and close that up and then close this over it like that get that all secured this section here will fold in on itself like that and then it will come up and tab in right there like that and there you have that side all situated. So you're going to do the same thing on the other side. Again, just give that piece more like a quarter turn here. So you can swing all this up. You're going to bend that knee, one click, collapse all this down. Again, make sure that hip skirt stays in. Bring that toe down. So you still have the clearance to move everything in. And you want to make sure that you get this panel in, like so. And again, this panel has to come down first. And then this panel will go over it, right here. Bring that in and close that up. Now you have less room here to work, so do the best you can to get everything tabbed in the way it's supposed to. Like 
Go. Push those feet up. Up. And you have less room to work here, so. There you go. And then, just collapse this onto itself. Like so. And then that will tab in right there. And there we go. So now that we've done that, take this section and bring it down. And you can just straighten those feet out. And there you have that ready to go. So now you can bring the head up. This panel here will come down. You have tab slot connections on either side right here. So just plug that in, plug that in. Um, you have these little panels here, these little green panels that you want to rotate up and rotate up like so. Then you want to bring this down. That will tab in right there to further lock that into place. And we are almost at the home stretch. So now we're going to bring in the tail. You just want to pull it apart. It pulls apart at three sections here, right here, right there, and right there. That gives you your tail articulation. You're going to open up these side panels here, rotate the handle 180, close that up, and then rotate it so this little tab right here is on top. That's how you want that oriented. And once you've done that, it will just sandwich in between the two halves here, and now you can proceed to tab everything together. So, get all secured. There you go. Can bring these sections down like that. And the last thing you're going to do is just rotate the legs forward, bring the toes forward, rotate, bring the toes forward. It's going to take the arms here, just swing them around, and Bend them up like so, and there you go. There you have Chomp in his alt mode, and to transform his headmaster, just gonna turn him around, untab his legs from his shoulders, bring those down. And untab the arms from that back panel. And there he is in robot mode. And to get everything transformed back up, we'll start with the headmaster. And again, you want to tab those arms into that back panel. Like so. Bring the legs up. You have a tab slot connection right there into the shoulder. Just tap that in and tap that in like so. And there he is back in head mode. And we'll put him off to the side. And now we can focus on chomp again. So, what we're going to do here is we're going to undo this, bring that up, take the legs, and just rotate them up, bring the toes back. And just rotate that up, bring the toe back, rotate that up. Now you want to flip these little panels back down on either side and untab So next section here. Let's pull that out like so. And that will allow you to then separate this, pull the tail out, and the tail, again, you just want to give this a quarter of a turn, open up these side panels here, flip this out, flip out the handle, close it back up, and then just compress these three sections back in to form the sword. And we can put that off to the side. And now that we've done that, 
we can open up this section here and that will allow us to undo the legs so if you just give the legs a little wiggle those panels will come undone undo these undo these sections here and get all that open again just bring the toe down a little bit and also just bend the knee in one click because that will give you your clearance to swing this out like that. So at this point now you can close this up just to lock that knee in place. So bring all this down. You want to take this section here and tap it from itself and this will just swing under like so. Flip up that little section and you go flip in this bit here. Just collapse that up. Uh, this green section here you want to rotate it. So now that is facing the outside. So now you want to take the leg here, just want to give that a quarter turn, you want to pull it down, rotate it, and then pull it down again, rotate, and then push it up, so it sits right there in that groove, like that. Once you've done that, all of this will swing up, and get that toe out of the way, swing all this up and over, like that, open up this panel, and close this up. You have a couple connection points here. You have a tab that will go in here, and then you have tabs and slots right here. So just get all that lined up and push together like that. Then you can just bring the foot up and can rotate it back down, bring that the rest of the way, and you can use the tail to get his uh, heel spur out. Bring that toe down. And there you go. Then you can rotate the leg 180. And you got that done. And you gotta do the same thing on the other side. And now that the legs are all done, then we can bring these little panels down. And we can close these back up like so. And then we can just bring all of this down. This section here has a little tab for it, so I'll just secure itself in place, bring it down. That will tab in right in there, into the body, like that. You can take this little tab, flip that in, close that up right there. And we'll do the arms here, so you just pull these out, rotates, and you want to bring toes down halfway so you can open this up you can open the bottom up, up as well so you can push the hand out and then you can close the bottom one up bring that down bring the hand out the rest of the way and close that up like that and same thing on the other side just extend it rotate the bicep just bring it down halfway open up both sides you can push that up close that up bring that down down close rotates bring that down and we can rotate his waist back around. And all there's left to do, flip in these chest spikes, plug his head back on. And there you have Fans Toys Chomp back in robot mode.